feel comfortable. We'll do it again. Come on. Sit here. Tale of the tape, a secret recording of Harvey Weinstein and allegations of sex abuse, but why wasn't he charged? Good evening, I'm Christine Johnson. And I'm Maurice Dubois. We begin with that war of words between the NYPD and the Manhattan DA over one of the biggest names in Hollywood. It comes as two A-list stars join a growing list of women who accuse Weinstein of sexual harassment. CBS 2's Brian Connie Bear here with a fallout and also response from the movie Mogul's Wife. Brian. Yeah, Christine and Maurice, the sordid downfall of Harvey Weinstein Weinstein is still unfolding. Tonight, his own wife, Georgina Chapman, told People Magazine her husband's actions were unforgivable and that she is now leaving him as more allegations pour in from some of Hollywood's biggest stars. A-list actresses Angelina Jolie and Gwyneth Paltrow tell the New York Times they were sexually harassed by Harvey Weinstein early in their careers. Jolie saying she, quote, chose never to work with him again and warn others when they did. Paltrow says she told her then-boyfriend Brad Pitt, who confronted Weinstein. But Paltrow kept working with him and didn't go public until now. I was expected to keep the secret, she said. The most damning allegations came in an article by the New Yorker magazine that quoted three women who said they were raped by Weinstein. His spokesperson saying, quote, any allegations of non-consensual sex are unequivocally denied by Mr. Weinstein. The magazine also released a 2015 undercover NYPD recording of Weinstein and Italian actress Ambra Batalan Gutierrez as he tried to get her into a hotel room at the Tribeca Grand. I don't feel comfortable. I mean, don't Gutierrez went to police after she says Weinstein grabbed her chest. Yesterday you touched my wrist. Please, I'm sorry. Just come on. I'm used to that. Are you used to that? Yes, come in. No, but I'm not used to that. I won't do it again. Come on. Sit here. Sit here for a minute. The NYPD says it referred the case to the Manhattan DA's office, but DA Cy Vance Jr. declined to press misdemeanor sex abuse charges, saying his office was not consulted before the undercover recording, tweeting, quote, while the recording is horrifying to listen to, what emerged from the audio was insufficient to prove a crime under New York law, which requires prosecutors to establish criminal intent. The NYPD says its experienced special victims unit handled the case using well-established investigative techniques, something paid University law professor Bennett Gershman backs up. You are listening to a, a sexual pervert ply his trade. It, it's so easy. And so for a prosecutor to say there's not proof of criminal intent, that's what the prosecutor Vance said. That's just so, so wrong. Actress and screenwriter Lucette Geis is the latest Weinstein accuser. I do not think that Harvey Weinstein understands or comprehends how much pain and suffering this brings to me and scores of other women. Democrats who accepted past campaign donations from Harvey Weinstein blasted him today. Hillary Clinton saying she is shocked and appalled. President Obama saying he is disgusted. And the Weinstein Company's board, including Harvey's brother Bob, just denied that they had any prior knowledge of what they called the extreme sexual misconduct and sexual assault allegations. Christine Maurice.